Hey y'all, what's up, what's up, what's up my Aries? Hope y'all doing good today, hope y'all doing good. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning, hey family, you already know how we do. Um, I don't even know y'all did. So I wanna, um, I'm a, this is Aries for masculine and feminine, taken and single. Uh, remember that readings are timeless. So whenever you see this reading, you were meant to see this reading, um, as well as there are no genders in tarot. So you can be a masculine or a feminine energy resonating as the opposite sex, all right? Um, make sure if you haven't already to subscribe to my channel i know you're gonna love this energy and um hit that like and that bell um for future reads as well as tomorrow 7 p.m central standard time i am going live uh me and the tribe we do some healing we do some i do general message just for those that are on the live um as well as we do some yoga we do some healing i give some oracle messages we play some test your intuition games so come on out join the family we're currently we just got done with our root chakra you could go in and uh find those root chakra videos to catch on to those it's usually an hour up videos that are my live videos um and now we are on our sacral chakra if anyone wants to join in we are reading the book pussy prayers if you want to come join in and read that book with us um just hit me up and i'll send it to you join the tribe we out here healing building and having fun all right y'all we about to play this singing bowl i only play it for about a second or two and then i'm gonna jump right into this message and this is for my arrogant aries That was strong. Y'all needed some cleansing, huh? All right, let's see what y'all reading. Let's see what y'all reading behooves. I already shuffled. I was going to shuffle again, and I shuffled off the deck. They said, you better not. I was going to shuffle again. <laughs> I shuffled so much, you guys. Okay, so we're going to jump right into this message. We're going to jump right in, Aries. Please send me clear, guided, and understanding messages for my Aries. Give me one moment, y'all. My cards be. I'm a little rough. I'm a little heavy handed. <laughs> I'm a little heavy handed. And this is for my Aries. This is for my masculine and feminine Aries. There we go. Justice. Okay. So I'm definitely seeing whatever you guys are going through, whether it's a relationship, um, whether it's a breakup and you feel like this person did you wrong, left you out in the cold, whether it's a job, y'all going to get y'all justice. Let me tell you, arrogant Aries, y'all, and it's coming fast. Y'all justice is coming fast, arrogant Aries. Okay. Y'all going to get y'all justice. Um, this either has to do from somebody cutting you out or you cutting somebody out in the past. But baby, let me tell you, it's coming fast. You're justice, okay? So get out of whatever energy you are feeling. Get out of it. Um, it's you about to get your justice, baby. You could also be dealing with the Libra. For my Aries, you guys could be dealing with the Libra. Okay, so these cards was gonna come out before y'all, and I put them back and they came out again. That sh is crazy. Okay. So da, 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 that came out as the, you your overall you getting your justice. These three came out together, so we're gonna keep these together just like this. Um, you guys have the four of cups, the two of cups, and then you guys have the six of pentacles, right? So for right now, I, I'm definitely definitely seeing that y'all y'all worried about the past, right? Y'all focus is on the wrong thing. Spirit is basically I'm gonna show y'all your cards. Spirit is basically trying to give you another offer, offer you a better, something better, but y'all stuck on somebody who was basically penny pinching you in the past and y'all not letting this person go for my Aries. Um, and because you guys are not letting this person go, you guys are not getting your wish fulfillment. Spirit is, I do see that a lot of you guys are working on yourself, which is good. Spirit is saying, yes, continue to stack your coins and work on yourself. But right now you are worried about, you know, someone coming in and giving you something emotionally and giving you something um, financially, right? 
but you guys are thinking about somebody from the past that wasn't no good that you were supposed to be leaving in the past when spirit is trying to offer you this cup of love of something so much better y'all see this two of cups so spirit is telling you stop looking at the past as you looking at the past spirit is trying to from the clouds anything from the cloud is from spirit spirit is trying to offer you something so much greater but you too busy looking at this you too busy like ah oh, no nah, i can't leave this behind and go to something greater why you can't Ask yourself why you can't, why you can't go to somebody that's going to give you an equal give and take. You don't feel like you deserve, deserve equal. I, I, answer that question. I, I, I'm, all right. But yeah, I'm definitely seeing you guys are, you guys are, are worried about something from the past. Right. And um, just as soon as you get out of that energy, your cup of love is going to come. Your equal, your yin to your yang, not two of cups. You could also be seeing two, 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 two. I know I'm seeing that heavy. Yeah, this is somebody in the past. They did you wrong. You got the ten of swords. You guys, uh, you guys were done. You was done with it. Like whatever they did, they backstabbed you so hard it caused you to walk away. But you are still thinking about going back to them. And spirit is like, no. Think work, work on yourself. Work on giving yourself um, this unconditional love. Uh, work on building your own coins so you don't have to go back to this person who was penny pinching who was giving you bare minimums you feel me also given to other people i just heard they was given to other people when they knew that you was in need um, like they knew that you was in need they was dating they was dating you but giving to other people like you don't deserve that so, oh this came out fast and it came out to the and it came out backwards y'all see how this it didn't fly out this way y'all don't even think y'all seen how it flew out because it flew out backwards because y'all y'all spirit is telling you it's time to take another route so y'all can get this ace of love this 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 fulfillment it's time to move forward do you get what i'm trying to say it's time to move forward and get out of this energy just as soon as you get out of this energy then your ace of cups is gonna come and it's gonna come fast like if y'all would have seen how that card just flew out, um, just flew out of that deck right there. Like as soon as you get out of this Ten of Swords energy, then your Ace of Cups is going to come in. You feel me? But you got to, got to, got to, got to, got to, got to, got to get out of that sad and sorrow energy because right now you are blocking the good from coming in. Don't nothing, honestly, everything is about attraction, law of attraction. We know that, right? So nothing, no one wants to be around a sad, depressed person. You get what I'm trying to say? They always, people always gravitate to the one who look like they the happiest, who got the most stuff, who got, you get what I'm trying to say? So it's time to get into that energy that you are. It's time to get into that arrogant Aries energy. You feel me? It's time to get into that energy and understand your worth so you can get this Ten of Pentacles. So you can get this Ten of Pentacles. Stop, work, stop worrying about whatever the person did from the past. They are going to get their justice as well as for some of you guys. Stop trying to basically cause them to get like basically... What I'm saying is for some of you guys, this is the story. They did something in the past. They hurt you. So you basically trying to turn around and try to figure out ways to hurt them. Spirit is saying, no, get your whole attention off of them. It's time to focus on you and elevate all that focusing on how to how to um, hurt them is taking the greatness away from you. Do you get what I'm trying to say? You just move on and love arrogant Aries. We don't do none of that. Get back tit tat. Nah, I'm telling you. Let spirit handle it. Spirit is going to handle it. Let spirit handle it. When I say, y'all got some heavy hitters, Aries. Y'all got some heavy hitters. Y'all ancestors don't play about y'all. Let them handle this person. You are going to get your justice. Let them go. Whatever it is, let it go. Let that hurt go. Forgive them. Yes, I'm telling you to forgive them. Forgive whatever they did, giving to somebody else. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing that they was giving back. They, some of them, they went back to their baby mama. Some of them, they went back and had sex with their baby mama, Aries. And it is okay. It's okay. Stop. Don't. We not crying over spilled milk. We not crying over them giving. We not crying over them taking whatever they took from you and got on and went to somebody else. We not crying over none of that. We, we about to get out of this energy so we can get, th get into this energy. Do y'all hear me? Do y'all hear me? I know y'all hear me. So spirit is definitely saying to get out that energy because somebody is about to come offer you this cup of love. Somebody is about to come offer you this cup of love. But you got to get out of this one. Oh my God. Let me try to get back at this person. Oh my God. Why did I allow this person to do this to me? Oh my God. Because that they did it because that's who they was. Fuck trying to figure out why they did it. How can I? No, they did it because that is who they are. <laughs> Period. Yeah, people can change, but they don't change overnight. Believe me, and I'm, I'm one powerful person, and it took me a while to change. So understand, understand. Get out that energy. 
Stop trying to go back tit for tat and figure out ways to hurt and give them. Yeah, they went back and gave to somebody else. Yeah, they see they left you out in the cold. Yeah, they went some of them. They went back and had sex and was given to their baby mama. Yeah, you feel like they was give they give their baby mama more love and attention than they give you. Yeah, because their baby mama knew how to knew her worth. You get what I'm trying to say? You gotta know your worth. Once you know your worth, then a person gonna come in and treat you as such. Do you get what I'm trying to say, Aries? I'm telling y'all the jewels. I'm giving. I'm dropping y'all the jewels. I'm dropping y'all, and I know. Oh yeah, I'm acting. I'm acting like I know my worth. I'm acting like I, hiding, making it. Oh, I ain't got no insecurities. No, that's in your ego. That's not healing. That's not saying. Oh yes, this is what it is. This is what it ain't. And this is what I'm gonna say. It is. You get what I'm trying to say? Y'all need to understand. How can I? How can I put this? Hold on. Give me one moment. Basically, y'all need to go within and heal yourselves emotionally. Stop running from your own feelings, Aries. It's like y'all try to act like y'all not hurt. Y'all try to act like y'all not this. And it's only hurting yourself in the long run. Um, acting like you're okay. Acting like this. Acting like you don't need someone. You get what I'm trying to say? No, it's, it's okay to be vulnerable. And that's as a male or a female. Masculine or feminine. You get what I'm trying to say? It's okay to want love. It's okay to um, want to be with a companion. We're not meant to be with ourselves. You get what I'm trying to say? What is not okay is running from your true, actual feelings. And so many people in the world, they run from their feelings and they stick in their ego um, because of what other people may think or because of societal norms, which is not really the freaking normal. You get what I'm trying to say? It's time to hop out of this brainwashed thinking and not at all of this other BS and get into really loving yourself, really knowing your worth really digging deep, deep and saying what it is that you are going to take from a person what you are not going to take from a person and and setting those boundaries and sticking to those boundaries aries do you hear me and once you do that and you cut out the things that no longer serves you, then you can get out of this toxic energy. Then you can get out of this 3D devilish energy and you can um, you can really, 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 really get your justice. You can get your equal, your equal give and take. Um, and again, remember, some of you guys, the roles can be reversed. The roles can be reversed. Um, but yeah, I'm seeing, that's what I'm seeing for you guys. It's time to get out that energy. Um, your justice is going to come. Forget that person uh, that did you wrong in the past, that left you heartbreak. You about to get a new cup of love. Somebody else is about to come in and they're going to come in. Like as soon as you let this person go and you, oh, it's a new moon. I mean, we managed, I mean, release on a new moon too. Shoot. You can release tomorrow on a new moon. As soon as you release this person, right? As soon as you release this person, let this person go. You can bring in your new. Um, do some self love candles tomorrow, or some self write down some self some things that you you know, some self love things or whatever. Um, but yeah, it's it's time it's time to pour into yourself. It's time to pour into yourself, Aries. Okay, it's time to dig deep. Um, get into your emotions, get into your emotions. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like you guys need to get in touch with your emotions more. Okay. Uh, for my Aries, y'all could be dealing with the water sign that's cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Y'all got a little bit of, um, of air here and a little bit of pinnacles here for some of y'all, but I have absolutely no fire. So I'm not seeing any fire, but I am seeing, um, cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, uh, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and then your Aries. Leo, um, Aries, Leo is a Sagittarius. Yeah. So those are the signs that I am seeing. No, 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 no. Um, what is it? What I say? Air signs. Well, y'all know y'all air signs. My brain is just like, right now. I hate it. <laughs> Let me get y'all air signs. I know. So I can get y'all signs. When I'm doing too much, my brain just be going blank. Okay, wait. Hold on. So, fire. Okay. 
So yeah, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay, yeah, so Aquarius, Libra, Libra Gemini. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Scorpio, Pisces. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. There you go. I was I was going to try to find it in the book. Couldn't find it in the book. So I just have to remember off the top of my head, y'all. <laughs> so yes, 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 yes. That's what it is. Um, those are your signs to look out for. And that's what it is, y'all. Peace.